Hello and welcome to the I Hate Jokers run. If you love Bellatro but hate Jokers, this is the run for you. That's right, we finally beat the Jokerless challenge, arguably the hardest challenge in the game. This one took me a lot longer to beat than any other challenge, so I was glad to get this one out of the way. Word of warning, I did re-roll for the investment tag, which gives me $25 after beating the anti-1 boss. So that jump start to the economy really helps out in getting a run going, so no shame in that. Uh, it is raining pretty hard here, so you may hear thunder from time to time, so apologies in advance. Anyway, let's get into the run. All right, so like I said, we had the we had the re-rolled till we saw the investment skip, so we're we're just starting out from the from the roll the, from the re-roll screen here. So first blind, you're you're either looking for a flush or a high straight. That flush is not going to do it for us, but that one will. All right, so we keep our we keep our four dollars. We get another six from winning here. So now we have ten, which is nice for two bucks interest. Generally, don't buy anything in this first shop unless there's just something really really cool. So we skip for the twenty-five dollars. Uh, we don't get it until after we defeat the boss. So we still have to beat this boss, which you can do in two flushes or three high straights this is a low flush I mean by low I mean less than 300 so we're gonna have to make up for those points if, if we want to if we want to do this in two hands uh, kind of looking at the the suits now maybe go for the club flush instead discard the the two of clubs so we didn't get the club flush there so we're gonna have to spend a hand to look for more clubs so there we go that is that enough for 600 a hey. nice so we, we get out with a dollar for our hand and the uh, and the two. So we have $43 now. Like, when you get to any two and you have $43, that's neat. Uh, I'll tell you. These aren't the greatest planet card. I mean, it's hard to... I mean, oh, that's a cool jack. A uh, uh, Red Seal Malt Jack. I like that a lot. Uh, so here, I picked up this stone card with the with the hollow, the ten malt. Um, you know, I I won't comment any further, but that's uh, something that we picked up <laughs> that may help later. All right, so we have that cool jack. That's pretty nice. Hey, check out this. Check out that flush, or. or no, what? Oh yeah, we're gonna play the flush. So the red seal with the malt card. That's pretty strong. So we're out of here in one hand. So that's nice. So we get we get our five. That's another thing. Oh, but there there's the there's the flush. So that's you know flushes are pretty easy to play uh, early on. You get the most bang for your buck. Uh, with flushes and straights uh, you know flushes can be generally I think easier to play than straights it depends so we get the telescope voucher so we are spending some money there I got that before opening the planet pack knowing that it would have a Jupiter in there hey we get a red sealed jack or sorry purple sealed jack so I'm kinda looking at jacks thinking Hmm. I don't pick up the uh, the Earth Planet card. All right, so we have a flush draw. There's a three of a kind there. Maybe I'm looking for a full house. Well, there's a four of a kind. Lucky us. So the, I don't that that doesn't win, does it? Hmm. No. Oh, not even close. Uh. Okay. So we're looking for 
Oh, there's a full house. That should win. Right? <clears throat> I do have one more discard, so... Maybe, maybe looking to bring out that cool jack. The red seal. Malt. Uh... Oh, we're gonna play the pair. Okay, all right. Maybe bringing out the purple seal. I see what you're doing. I see you. All right, we're discarding there. Okay, so we have the pair with the uh, with the nice stone card, hollow stone card. That's that's not a bad card to have in your back pocket. Like you got the chips from the stone and the the malt from the hollow. And we did level, level up pair one or two times, I think, so... Alright, we get the, uh... We take the Earth this time. Magician? I like lucky cards. Hmm... Death? Or... <clears throat> I mean, I really would have loved, uh, you know, like one of those sealed cards for the death. And just mulling over my options. We're gonna we're gonna death a queen maybe. Yeah, yeah. We did level up full house, so may maybe we're just going jacks and queens, eh? That's a plan that we could keep in mind. I'm looking at my suits, realizing that flush is my highest level, so I pick up the star. All club cards are debuffed. Unfortunately, that cool jack is a club, but good, we have a star, so if should we draw it, then... Uh, hey, there's a, there's a purple seal. But we have a full house. So maybe we just... Uh, yeah, what do we do here? We did just level up our full house, but that that purple seal is cool. But, you know, we, we maybe uh, want to use one of those. Yeah, there we go. So we lucky up the jack and the ten. Yeah. Discarding, maybe hoping for another jack. So we have the full house there with a lucky jack and a lucky 10. Uh, we do have a, a tarot card there. Okay, we're, we use the, we use the star. Uh, we use the star to, uh, to undebuff the, uh, okay, then we, then we bonus up those. Yeah, I figured this might be good enough. Maybe if we get lucky with a with a lucky card with some malt on it, or oh, I'm uh, yeah, I'm uh, the the flush is higher level than the full house, so that's that's a good idea. Damn it, we didn't get any uh, procs from the malt, so we have to play another another hand or maybe two. Right, so we're discarding the debuff cards. Maybe looking for, eh, we don't get a whole hell of a lot here. Uh, looking at the suits, maybe go for the uh, spade flush? I don't know, man. It's hard, to, it's, oh boy. We're uh, checking out the suits again. We don't have many diamonds, so we can get rid of those. Just play it and pray. Oh boy. <laughs> we get shit. At this point, I figure the run is over. <clears throat> I don't do any math. I figure the best we have is pair. Pair is slightly better than two pair. We, we did level up pair once, so the only pair we have is a king and a debuffed. And we get 1,600 points on the nose. Oh my god, this run almost died there. I was shocked. I didn't think we had enough. I mean, you know, I could have done the math easily, but... You know, who wants to do math when you play video games? You know, I might as well level up the flush again. 
We have $10. Do we want to keep that for the interest? Checking out the deck. Maybe pick up the... Uh... Okay, pick up the Hierophant just to get a little extra help with scoring because... I don't know, it's kind of rough. Uh, so we got a pair there with the... Uh... With the hollow stone card. I'm guessing maybe we play that. Yeah. Good idea. Yeah, that's that's going to be pretty nice. It gets us over halfway there. So you can't complain about that. Hey, there's a full house. Is that good enough? Uh, damn it. Not quite. So we play another pair and get out of here. Ah, temperance. My, my muscle memory is so strong with temperance, I'm just, I, whenever I see it, I just want to use it. But it's, it does nothing, this run. Unforge. Okay, so... We have a fool here. So I'm kind of like, I don't want to use the Hierophant in... F like, I don't want to fool that, so I sell it. I believe the fool, yeah, the fool has a, a Jupiter card, which I figure uh, the extra chips and malt on a flush. I'm kind of committing to the flush now. We have a star in hand. So there's a death. Make another queen. <clears throat> so that's kind of why I was picking up the the earth cards maybe possibility of of uh you know full house with jacks and queens or was it 10 no jacks and queens we do have a cool lucky 10 oh god that pair sucked all right so i know i have the i know i have the star in hand so if something goes bad then i figure i have an out Five queens, five jacks. <clears throat> Maybe we actually get rid of some... Uh, no, we keep the kings. Okay, so there's there's a... Uh, there's a full house with the cool jack. Um, but maybe I want to use the star and make it a flush. But I want to be careful. I don't want to make it a flush house. Well, actually, we can't. There's, there's, yeah, we, we, we can't make a flush house right now. But that is a consideration. Yep, so we play the, the face cards with the cool red seal malt jack. Like that. Ah, nice. We're out of here. Sweet. We get a full? Nice. I'll use that to make some more diamonds. I'm liking this so far. Chariot. That's big. I do chariot the high card, which I probably maybe should have charioted the low card, but that's fine. Alright, we, we pull out the steel. That's pretty cool. Steel's pretty pretty important in these runs. I've learned. Uh, don't discard the diamond. Discard the heart. Oh, there you go. Alright, so we got a flush now with a steel in hand. Two luckies. Surely this wins. Well, maybe not. Oh, we did get the 20 malt. Wow. Okay. <laughs> we, we, we didn't win with the, with the 20 malt. Okay, we have a cool pair there with the... Uh, now this probably wins. The pair with the uh, the hollow stone. Oh, we're 13 off. Well, that's awkward. So we just play... Uh, what? Play another just... Oh, maybe discard? Well, yeah. Maybe I play this? Yeah. It's gonna be too much. <laughs> I was trying to like maybe maybe bring out the purple seal, but yeah. 
I mean, that was an extra large blind, so that's, you know, to be fair, uh, there, there's a, a high point requirement there, so that's okay. Apparently now our pair is our, our most played hand because it's all the way to the left, but thankfully we did get a, a Jupiter in that pack. Mm. I don't want to take any, even though it's foil, I don't think I want to take any non-diamonds at this point. Even though I do have a star in hand. Uh, level up the four of a kind because I do have a lot of queens and jacks, so, you know, leaving up, leaving the option open. If, if flush gets too weak. That was a pretty cool tag, double your money. Uh, but I just decided to go next. All right. That wasn't great. Okay. All right. I like this. We have a magician and we have some naked cards there. Yeah, yeah. We want a we want a magician. <clears throat> oh, why did I play the 6? Should have played the king there, but uh, it's 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 enough, more than enough. Nice, another Jupiter. We love to see those. And a planet pack. Wow, thankfully. Does that does that mean that pair is our most Okay, we get a nice hollow malt jack. Even though it's not diamonds, I want to pick that up because I can make it a diamond. So that's hollow and malt is 10 plus 4. So that's 14 malt on one card. That's nice. <laughs> hey, there it is! There's the card, we can make it a diamond. Oh my god. Beautiful. Maybe look to bring out some more, more cards. Hey, we got some cool cards here. We make those into a diamond. If we play it, well, we don't have any steals in hand, but I'm thinking if we play, well, oh, I'm discarding. Okay. I'm thinking this has got to one-shot it. With a lucky card, bonus card, malt, like... Oh, damn. Well, well, you know. <laughs> oh, maybe the pair does it? Yeah, true. See? The, the, the malt, the, uh, a, a hollow stone card. It's, uh, it's coming to play here a few times. Damn it, I wish that Temperance did something. Uh, purple Seal, and it's a diamond, so we'll take it. Right, money. The money, I... Oh, it's a, it's a Mega Arcana, so we can... We can death. Unfortunately, we we can't death a, a cool diamond, just a regular old vanilla diamond. Uh, but maybe we just... Or... Oh, we strength. Okay. So I decide to... Just in case I decide to play, like, some... Uh, switch, switch to full house or four of a kind or something like that. Okay, we have a full. Decide to use it for a strength. Still, you know, I'm still not completely committed to flushes at this point, I guess. All right. And I'm looking at my my levels, my four of a kind, my fl my flush is still my my flush still outscales uh, everything else. Hey, look at look at this. That's pretty neat. <clears throat> Alright, so we have a flush with uh, three luckies, two bonus, and a steel in hand, and a partridge and a pear tree. Oh, we strength it? Okay. So, yeah, I still... Oh, I'm thinking that that's a bad idea because I'd be playing a flush house. That's, yeah, smart. You better hold on to that strength. Because if I strength a 10 into a jack, my flush house is undoubtedly much worse than my flush at level 8 or whatever it is. Hermit? 
Oh my god. We have $77. Oh. The money. We take the tarot merchant voucher, which is huge. Because we we have enough uh, scaling for our flushes by by the telescope voucher, so we we thankfully our, our flush is now uh, our most played hand again. So we're gonna we're gonna find a a Jupiter in every planet pack. Oh, I I take the Mars. See, I'm not totally sold on the flushes, which I mean the Mars at level whatever it was four is. I mean the the four of a kind does scale faster than the flush. But as of right now, the flush is still better. We find an Emperor, take that with us. Okay, the Pillar, this is a really bad boss. And I'm looking at the skips. We skip for $25 and then double our money. I, I, it, it, I had to because there's no way that we could play all of our diamonds in uh, the, the first two rounds of this ante and survive. I, I, I don't think so I I think that was the right call I mean it's obviously it's the right call because I won the challenge but uh, yeah that that boss I I, wa I wasn't having it I didn't I didn't want any part of that boss <laughs> I wanted to be able to to play all my cool cards because uh, you know one flush isn't gonna do it I mean you know we have we, we can Empress I don't think it does I, let, let's see. So we have a lucky two malt cards, a bonus. Yeah, not even close. So we'd have to play like two flushes every, you know, round. Yeah, it's that we we wouldn't have uh, we wouldn't have got past that boss, I don't think. So we play here, maybe looking for another purple seal. Yeah, kind of seeing what we have. Maybe we play here? Okay, we're playing the hand, keeping a discard. Because I know I can probably bring out uh, enough here. So, you know, I, I knew we had a magician in hand. So, uh-oh. Oh, okay, we stri Okay, we make another jack. Then, uh, lucky up the... The queen and the ace. So I figure we have enough technology in this hand to win. I mean, we have luckies, we have a hollow malt card. Like, that's pretty neat. Uh. Oh. Yeah, we, we had another discard, so I figure I might as well just uh, use it. Maybe get an ace instead of the seven that we were going to play. Maybe get us a, a few more chips. Alright. We we com we win comfortably. And we have the investment tag, so we get 25 buckaroos. $108. Oh. When you have money, you can do anything. Yes, we're, we're flush with, with cash, and we, we level up the flush. Uh, there's a blue seal, and it's a diamond, and it's a gold card, so why the hell not? I generally don't want to add too many cards to the deck, unless they're really cool cards. Well, there's a malt six, so <laughs> I'll take it. We got kind of lucky with those, with those packs. Still leveling up the full house. I don't know. I don't know, dude. I guess the full house does scale, uh, okay, we get a chariot and a fool, so that, that is some bacon saving technology right there, should we need it. Ooh, emperor and magician. Ooh, there's so many cards that I want here. That's a, that's a tough call. Magicians are nice, cause you play a bunch of luckies, you're bound to get that 20 malt in, in one of those one of those instances, right? So we go with the magician, the chariot, and the fool. Not a bad, uh, not a bad uh, setup of tarot cards here. Yeah, I decide to discard the naked four. Okay. So we have a four of a kind here. 
with jacks. I'd like to play those jacks. Yeah, I, I'm looking at m maybe making the, the queen into a steal. Maybe we play the four of a kind here? Maybe we have enough... Uh, okay, we make, we make that into a steal. Sorry, I'm playing a little bit slow. A little bit... Yeah, we play the four of a kind here. Ah, uh, I shouldn't. I shouldn't have included that king. I figured we had enough stuff in our deck to where I could uh, draw another flush, but I shouldn't have played that king. I should have left the king. That was a that was a mistake. Or maybe maybe I actually thought it was a flush. Maybe I didn't realize it was a four of a kind. That's that's very possible. Oh, we get the blue seal. Nice. And we can, we have a lucky, we can, oh, we fold for the steel card, make the blue seal a steel card. Smart. And we, we lucky it up. So now we play a flush with all luckies, two steals in hand. That's gotta win for God's sake. We, we should get some 20 bucks here. Oh, there's a 20, 20 malt. We got one $20 and a 20 malt. And we get the, the free planet card. Beautiful. Yeah, I figured the uh, making the, the blue seal into a steel is gonna help us a lot more than the three bucks from the gold card. Because we have enough money right now. All right, so uh, we have a justice. So, you know, the score requirements are getting a little high, so I figure this naked five, we might as well make that into a glass. That's pretty nice. Nothing we want there. Reroll. Hanged man is okay. I'll take it. Temperance, uh, I want it. At this point, uh, maybe the full house dream dies. Uh, yeah, I roll past the full house. I figure I'm locked in for flushes now. All right, we have a lot of diamonds. Uh, all oh, okay. All face cards are hand, are are drawn face down. So that that's a really bad boss for for what we have. This this is not a great boss, but I figured. Well, I didn't know which boss I was gonna get by re-rolling, obviously. But I definitely wanted to re-roll the boss the boss blind with all face cards uh, face down. Because that's, that's hard to play around. So, you know, we're managing pretty well here. We have a death in hand. Maybe, uh... Maybe we just play, or no, we discard. I feel like I need to pull out something cooler. So, I play this hand. Try to draw out... Okay, we have the glass, so I figured that would be good enough. And it, we, we get another steal. So I figure two glass, two luckies, a malt card, like, that's gotta be enough. Yeah, and we didn't break them. That's nice. So we're, we're, we're dipping our toes into the glass pool here. Uh, I look at the reroll voucher. Uh, I figure I'm not gonna get my money's worth out of that because we're on anti seven. So yeah, I I bypassed the the voucher there. So uh, we're uh, maybe make some lucky cards or what? What can we fool? What is the fool? The fool is a flush a planet card. I mean, our our flush level is pretty okay. Uh, decide to empress, or no? We we make luckies. I like the I like the magician card now that uh, you can make two cards lucky cards. Back in back in my day, <laughs> the magician card. 
would only make you one lucky card. So they're they're a lot more viable now that you can make two with every with every tarot card. All right, uh, we're re-rolling. Uh, maybe pick up the hanged man. It it can help. Get rid of those. Now we have a pair here with the uh, with the stone card. Maybe we play like that. Uh, well. We do have the purple seal, or maybe we just discard. Yeah, we just discard. We get a justice, so that's that's pretty neat right there. Cause at this point, uh, you know, we can make some more glass. All right, so. Yeah. Uh. Maybe trying to figure out what we want to do here. We have a, uh, looks like I'm trying to figure out what to death. Maybe a lucky card or maybe a steal. <laughs> I don't know. I'm so indecisive. Maybe the, the lucky card there, lucky ace. Yep. All right, we play that with two steals in hand. Maybe we can pull out a another naked diamond there. Maybe maybe make it into a glass. Uh, so we play like this to uh, pull out some more diamonds. Ooh, that's ugly. <laughs> can we get some more diamonds, please? Okay, we got some more diamonds. Another steal. Uh, I uh, certainly uh, glass this three, right? I'm kind of sad that I have to play the steel, but I think it's I think it'll be fine. That's that's definitely enough. I mean, we only have to score what l less than t twelve thousand. Yeah, I just pray it doesn't break. Yeah. I mean, I just wanted to be sure. We have had some some decent luck with glass cards so far. Okay, a fool, another justice. Hmm. Do we hang these men? Maybe hang the men and fool the hanged man? Probably the the play or Make the Jack a glass Okay, we, we hang it and then fool it or No, we we make a glass. Uh, I mean we have enough luck. Yeah, I mean that's that's a that's a good play we have enough lucky cards. Like at this point, you know, we we need to draw some glass probably. At least at least one. A glass and some other cool cards in hand. Hey, we get a purple seal. Neat. Sun, get out of here. Discard like this. Okay, we draw a glass. Nice. This might just win it for us. Uh, we chariot the two. Smart. This definitely wins. Well, I don't know. 52,000. That's pretty steep. We do get the 20. Oh, we get two 20 malts. So that's pretty huge. I love me some lucky card. Uh, death. Damn it. We get a death, but like we don't get one of those really cool cards. I mean, purple seal. I mean, we might as well. I mean, you could get a death from a purple seal. See, my 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 eyes immediately go to that temperance. 
See, why couldn't I get a death here? Like, I could death one of those lucky... Or death one of those steals. Death of lucky. Create two random planet cards. I figure my, my flush level is high enough. We just go next. Unfortunately, we're a dollar under 20, so that's fine. Yeah, I decide to uh, discard the naked diamonds. We don't get any steals, so that feels kind of bad. Maybe we just play the play the flush here. Okay, the, the score requirement is 70,000. Play the play the malt and the and the bonus. <clears throat> we get the twenty dollars and the twenty malt, so that helps. All right, so we have a glass in hand. We we we're, we want a steal. Okay, we get a steal. Nice. Or am I gonna play, or do we want to discard? Well. I'm probably scared. <laughs> this has got to be enough, or, or no, it's not enough. Yeah, I was scared to. I was scared to use my discard on just that that just that purple seal. Yeah, that that was smart to to retain my discard there because now. Um, uh, Maybe we do play another hand just to see if we can pull out another. Uh, oh, 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 yeah, we <laughs> we make that a wild card. I thought making it a wild card would allow me to play it as part of a flush, but because it's debuffed, the it's it's no longer a wild card. It's just a heart. I think it's an underneath. It's a heart. So the game treats it as a heart because the the wild card is debuffed so i was like shit it's not a flush <laughs> uh so at this point maybe okay i'm playing the i'm playing the hand hoping that it's enough okay it's enough i was wondering maybe if i would just play Play the, the heart cards there. Alright, we got another slot in the shop. Nothing we can really use here. Yeah. I mean, at this point, we're... We don't care too much about ranks. Well, we use the star there. Bonus. I mean, better than nothing. <clears throat> Alright, so... Only thing we can use here is a star, so maybe... Yeah, that wild card. I figure there's no point in making that a, a diamond. Yeah, I roll right past that lovers because I don't want to deal with that tomfoolery anymore. Uh, Hangman, uh, I pick it up. Yeah, I mean we do have we do have a couple more rounds left till the boss, so uh, maybe uh, maybe we maybe we hang those uh, that ace and queen or. Oh, see? Yeah, see? I remember. Pepperidge Farm remembers. So I discard those like that. Uh, okay, we get a death. So there's a really cool... Uh, yeah, I'm looking... I'm actually looking for the... For that other jack. But honestly, like, the red seal... That's eight malt, right? Plus the chips from the red seal. So, you know, that's a good that's a good death target. Or the glass is probably even better. That's smart. We we want more uh, chance to draw glass there. I figure we don't need to play both glass. 
Yeah, maybe just play one glass. I don't think it wins. Okay, it doesn't win. But we do still have one discard. So we're we're kind of chilling. Nice, we get 20 bucks. Uh, we did get the lucky money too. The $20 from the lucky. Okay, surely this wins. But the glass and the steel. Yeah, baby. Uh, unfortunately, we break the glass, but that's fine. We, we've been making a few. We have probably, f I would say, five glass cards in the deck at this point. Maybe four or five. All right. Nothing we can really use in here. Not the, not the greatest pack in the world. So we skip. I have money, so I open up, you know, maybe there's a chance of getting something cool. Hermit. Yeah, I figure another hermit. I figure we're, we're getting close to the end here, so, you know, might want to just start spending down. Nice, we get a death. Yeah, Emperor, maybe we sell the, we sell, we kick out the Empress and we, we crown the Emperor. I think we, well, I think we just go next right now, huh? No, we reroll. Okay. You feel better for rerolling? Well, I guess we did reroll down to the, uh, to the, uh, whatever you call it. Hey, we get that cool, uh. We get that cool hollow malt jack. All right, so magician. Or uh, yeah, we uh, yeah. I figure a lucky card on the queen is better than a bonus. So this is gonna this score is gonna be with the the malt there. Like that's. That's pretty, uh, geez, not even half. <laughs> okay, maybe it's not as good as I thought. Ooh, two purple seals, nice. We discard those naked tens, even though they're diamonds. Yeah, it's a, uh, it's not looking great here. I, I'm not, I'm not enjoying the cards I'm seeing too much. I play that. I leave the naked seven. Okay, we do bring out a purple seal. So maybe we maybe we play and then hold our discard. Eh. Oh, we bring out the glass. That might be the saving grace right there. Oh, I was glad to see that. Oh, we get the we get the money and the malt. Nice. All right. This is it. Do or die. All right, we have fifty nine dollars. We have to spend down to zero because we are at the boss, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, we we've thinned the deck. Uh, I mean, by thin the deck, I mean we've. We've pretty well uh, shaved it down to, to diamonds, eh? I I was just looking at the uh, the little snapshot of the deck there. I open up the spectral pack. I mean, yeah, no. Maybe we uh, use an aura on that glass. Yeah, that that helps. That's not bad. All right, we get a level twenty flush. So we go into the boss with a level 20 flush. Beautiful. Might as well just keep re-rolling. <laughs> At this point, I figured I didn't need a star. You know, our... our uh, uh, that fool, actually. Uh, I should... Yeah, I, I didn't pick that up. That was a mistake, because I should have sold the Empress. That would have given me $3. I could have picked up the fool. But that's okay. 
So the boss forces one card to be selected. This right here is perfect. Absolutely perfect. We, uh, we play the glass there. It, it couldn't have gone any better. Well, unless there was a steel in hand. All right, so we get 43K. Nice. So we're forced to we're forced to select a steel here. So my thought is make this bad boy a glass. So that's going to help our score. So then we, you know, we have other diamonds, cool diamonds in the hand. We play it, we play it. Oh, we did it, baby. 120k, we, we had two hands left, two discards left, easy boss. That is the Jokerless Challenge right there. We did it with flushes. Very cool. So as you can see, I got the achievement there. That was my last achievement to get. Uh, so, or yeah, that, or that, that was my last challenge run. So I got the achievement with the, the final challenge run. So that was tough. That, I, I grinded this one for a little bit. I mean, I wasn't at it like all day, every day, but you know, here and there I was, I, I give it some attempts and, uh, it was kind of tilting because I, I would always just do something stupid where like I, I would play a hand that I, I thought I was playing another hand or you know, I, I was on my last hand and I didn't realize I was on my last hand. I, I feel like I had a lot of opportunities to get it sooner, but that's okay. We, we got it. We, we got all the challenge runs done. We got the achievement. And now the only achievement left for me at, at, the, at this moment on June 25th, 2024, uh, I have to get the Completionist Plus, which is Gold Stake Every Deck, and Completionist plus plus which I'll never get which is a gold sticker on every joker that one's gonna be rough although I have been watching a lot more uh, gold stake streamers and kind of absorbing their thought processes and the jokers they pick up and the decisions they make so more to come on gold stake maybe you know that would be that's my next uh, thing well, before I get to Gold Stake, my next thing is to actually, you know, get... <laughs> I haven't done many high stake runs on many of the decks, so... Uh, you know, I have to build my way up to Gold Stake on every deck, but... Yeah, if that's the kind of thing you're interested in, maybe I'll uh, start streaming that kind of thing on Twitch. I don't know. Uh, I feel like the gold... The... the having... Uh, Gold stake on every deck, Completionist Plus, is doable for me. I don't know that gold sticker on every Joker is doable for me. That's a long grind, and you have to be very talented at this game. And not to say I, I can't do it, but it's just a, a big time investment. Uh, but it's content, right? So maybe we'll get there someday. I don't know. For now, I'm, I'm just going to focus on getting all the, the stakes done for all the decks. So anyway, that's the Jokerless Challenge, the final challenge run uh, that, that, that I had to do. So likely the, the final challenge run that you'll see on this channel or uh, on my Twitch. Uh, I, I don't know that I would do a challenge run for fun. I feel like there's other things in this game that you can do. <laughs> I mean, I, I, can't, I don't see myself replaying challenges. Well, some of them actually are, are kind of fun. This Jokerless Challenge was actually more fun than I anticipated. I say fun, I mean it It, it got me pissed off a lot, but uh, it wasn't as impossible as I, as I thought it was when I first saw that. Anyway, I'm rambling. Uh, thank you for watching. Leave a like if you like the video. Uh, leave a comment if you so choose. You can follow me on Twitch. I do, st well, I, you know, I've taken a little bit of a break from streaming, but it's uh, twitch.tv slash brooksley. I'm sure I'll be streaming again at some point uh, with some Bellatro thrown in. So, yeah, thanks again, and I will see you next time.